SMC connects you to experts about crop protection and agronomic insights. Join Jake Turner for another conversation sure to be worth your time. It's my understanding that Flutriafol has an extremely interesting history. Uh, it started out in cotton and uh, grapes and then moved into corn. Uh, can, Kiana, can you start us off by telling us about the journey that Flutriafol has made? Absolutely. And Jake, you're, you're absolutely spot on with that. It started protecting plants from cotton fruit rot. And so we moved from cotton into the vineyards where we are providing po um, foliar protection to our grapes, to our almonds, um, you name it. And then we, we, we realize the, these benefits that Flutriafol brings and we expand into more broader acres, be it corn, soybean, wheat. So Flutriafol has had a, a pretty exciting journey and we just continue to uncover different ways that we can use it to help give our growers more options. And Bruce, can you talk to us a little bit about how the systemic action of Flutriafol is part of its journey? Sure. Flutriafol was the key active ingredient to control an Asian soybean rust. And if we go back to 2005, the great Asian soybean rust scare that was going to take out all the soybeans in the U.S., well, that's how we got Flutriafol registered in the U.S. It was really the only AI that was giving cotton growers in that Texas, New Mexico area that have cotton root rot a chance to actually sustainable and produce a cotton crop. So then we transition, well, looking at this, what does it does? What does it do in vineyards? Um, that woody disease complex. What about when we move into almonds and standpoint of controlling, you know, blossom and blight? We've been using it in our fruit and vegetable in, over in the, in the East Coast for you know through drip controlling early blight alternaria and anthracnose diseases. Lo and behold, then you transition to our foliar uses. Uh, we launched Lucento, and then we, we gained a lot of market share. We're looking at Flutriafol control and frog eye leaf spot. It's phenomenal on frog eye leaf spot. And then we come to that present day where we launched Zyway, taking some of those lessons we learned in our fruit and vegetable crops and some of those in, in cotton, that soil use. Now we're taking that soil use to, to corn and looking at seasonal long disease protection in corn. Totally from the taking of something of AI that everybody would consider to be old and looking at a new application and you totally change the, the perception of that molecule. Be sure to tune into the next chapter to learn more about Flutriafol Active from FMC. Till next time, keep it on the upside.